<laughs> so sorry. You know you need to stop, right? <laughs> Dwayne is such a... Let me tell you, he okay. too much trouble in there. <laughs> okay. Serious business. A total of 51 travelers who attempted to gain entry to Jamaica were sent back to their original destination since the start of the COVID-19 outbreak. Dr. Christopher Tufton said, the decision to restrict travelers based on risk assessment was a strategic move to delay the virus from entering the island. Look here now. Every we, we start to talk about it, but it's gonna be the beginning and end all of all conversations for however long it takes for us to get it under control. Right. And that's just the truth. We're, we can't yeah. do anything about it until we air say, all right, vaccine are guilt. But, I mean, every, every measure, I'm supportive of every measure that is put in place to restrict this thing from getting Me into too. Thailand. Everything. If it means banning travel, I mean, you can't, if you stay at Jamaica, you stay at Jamaica. If you can't come at Jamaica, stay with probably there. But because me not, I don't want, you see this thing, I, I always say to myself, um, I don't like being sick. And whenever I get sick, I feel like the world is about to end. I'm yeah, we know. Yeah, yeah, you know, you know. You know me get sick, all that, all that go. Because, <laughs> you know, I'm crying and send messages to me, can't come at work and, you know. But I really, I, I'm supportive of every measure that is put in place to help protect our island. My, my only concern is if we ban and if we close our doors and we close our borders to all of this stuff, how does our tourism function, no, how does our... We mean a lot of things are going to get impacted. Yeah, we're yeah, going to yeah. get hit. Yeah. But, and not only are we going to get hit, financially we're going to suffer tremendously. Yeah, but that's, that's the impact. I guess that's, I better you have life, right? Yeah, Cause that's the impact. Because there's no way to spend the money. Because yeah. so. that's the impact of wars, that's the impact of um, health crises. As impact of drought, these are things that are natural occurrences, natural disasters. You know, you lose some things, but if you have life, as you said, we have the ability to come back. What's worse? Know? What's worse? Having a hurricane that knock out everything for like three months, or having this thing where we don't know what will happen for the next six months? I think this is worse. I, I think this you. is worse. Yeah, because you don't know what to it's expect. It's the unknown. Yeah. It's the unknown. Yeah, that's this is worse. Damaging. Yeah. Boy, guys, we said it already and we'll say it again. Make sure you have your alcohol, make sure you have your sanitizer, make sure you wash your hands two times. Sing happy birthday two times when you're washing your hands. Happy That's how long you need to wash your hands for. You. Try to, to limit the hugging and the... Yeah, just happy like that. Happy birthday to Limit the hugging and the kissing and the love up the, when you see people. Just rrr, wag wag my dopes and call it a day. Keep it trucking. The kissing part? I mean, kiss who you want, kiss like you, you know. Not you who you want, kiss, but you no. Know. I mean, like the one person, yeah. one that you always kiss. <laughs> <laughs> but like you can't be like kissing everybody because that ain't gonna help situations. Right? Look okay, at we're not moving <laughs> on. Now. Continuing on that note, twenty-one people, including nine crew members aboard a mammoth cruise ship off the California coast, have tested positive for the new coronavirus. U.S. Vice President Mike Pence announced on Friday. So... You saw the, you saw the ship? A picture, it, yeah. It's first. like four hotels. Yeah, man. But here's the thing. You can imagine being one of the people on the ship with do have it. Mm -hmm. And no, say so like, they saw. That's mad that they have it. And everybody's already panicking about it. And you can't come off. I remember the ventilation... The it's been. Recycling. You know, so me wouldn't go into that room there. Then I'll because go I would have been sitting on the outside taking in the sea breeze because yeah. they said it's not airborne. It's just a droplet, that's, yeah, that's surface what, contact. Mm -hmm. And so, you know. But what if you're in the ship and, you know, you're in a room and it goes in ventilation and it circles, like it circulates through the ship to the different ventilation spreads? So. But what happened, you know, there's a guy on one of these ships who came off the ship. Did all the tests, negative. he was fine. Yes, because and they then, didn't know how long the yeah. incubation period was and for. And 10 know, days later. Right. Now months. that they know that the incubation period is two weeks, then I'll just lock up. I don't you know. know. I, I feel like um, to an extent, well, it's right because you have to protect everybody else, mm -hmm. but then it's kind of inhumane because the other people are like, oh my gosh. Why? And for the greater good. For the greater good. Wow. Mm -hmm. A serious thing. But you know what I think about? Like the zombie apocalypse. What? No, I mean, zombie apocalypse. You've been watch watching movies. too much yeah, Walking it's true. Dead. It's true. You've been watching walking, too much Walking, walking dead. dead. I know that's yeah. what you're watching. So you know, you one person stop. get infected and everybody get infected. But they're not going around biting people. But still, you know, that's when pass off. No. See, DJ agreed with me. Yeah. DJ does he not said, agree. Yeah. DJ yes. agree with you. He say yes. DJ, what you watching on he, TV? But Walking Dead. It's true. Moving on. Anyway, uh, the video and images of a lifeboat docked at the King Yemen, I want to talk about this one. Showing people disembarking and getting into a vehicle are of 
nationals of several countries who left the container ship on a lifeboat to get food supplies. The Marine Police confirmed on Thursday. So everybody has seen the video and I said, one well, no. So it's a submarine, the Chinese are <laughs> sneaking to Jamaica to bring the COVID-19 to the shores. And it baffles me because oh, wow. I had to address some people at work um, about it because I, I work downtown close to the waterfront. So I was talking to some people who shared um, a picture and some videos. Say, you know, no, 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 no. <laughs> and they say, oh, the Chinese them come in a submarine. And I said, my, my problem is with social media, everybody wants to put things out there without even checking. Fact, no fact Nothing. check. Nothing. There's no fact checking, none at all. And it's the first time I ever used this. And I heard President um, Trump say it. <gasps> You're going to say something that President Trump Fake says? news. When you spread things like that, you cause panic. Right? And when, when I saw the video, and this girl who sent it to me, I said, did you watch the video? No. I said, what do you see in the video? People coming off the boat. I said, you would not see people carrying supplies to the, the lifeboat? Yeah. Oh, I didn't watch it, you know. I just shared it, but and, and that's, that's a problem. That's all we are. We problem. are panicky people. Anything happened, everybody got Jesus, and, I'm a mercy. And I can understand because somebody said to me, "Them not taking a check." We said, "Mercy, but that's a problem. We're not taking any checking, you know, so we don't check what is real and what is not before we spread the false information." Rumors, them spread, yeah, so we yeah. have to. <laughs> so we have to check whether it's you see it on the, on social media, whether you hear it in the news, you do your cross check checking. Yeah, man. Not to say that you're not supposed to keep yourself very contained mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. careful about check, what man. it is check. that you do on your interactions, but double check stuff yes. before you spread it. But you have people who want to break news. Yes, of course. To get more likes That's and That's why retweets. everybody have them phone like this. Yeah, and everybody. Nobody will even say, call, call the authorities to say, all right, this is what we see in downtown. No, man, we have to took this and put it on dream. Their dream and pink wall. A what? Their dream and pink wall. What is that? I'll tell you what it after the break. Oh, okay. That's it for the trending <laughs> topics. Anybody else who know what big dream? Dear, I mean, dear dream. Yeah. Dear yeah. Dream. Let, let me let me know. You know, you know what dear dream is, right? Yeah, man. Nita know what dear dream is. Speak up, dear dream. He don't know First what you're talking news. about. Nita know let what dear dream is. Let us know what you feel on all our social media platforms. But that's it this and, morning and for the trending dear topics. Dream. We're gonna take a break and we will be right back. Don't forget what is dear dream. Pink wall. Pink wall. I saw it yesterday for the what first time. Oh God, you know what I know. We're so calm. Painting pictures, making magic.